Hi guys, welcome back to Code Switch. All right. In one of our previous video, we discussed if we have a table already, how can we convert it back to a C# -sharp class? Now in this video, we are looking into if we already have a class, how can we convert it back into a table? Okay. So here I have a project and it got a class called employee.cs. Let's open it. And you can see this is my class. So if you want to convert this class into a database table, what you can do is that just select the class, just the class, not the namespace. Right click, click on copy. Now go to your Chrome to this website. I will put the link of this website in the description. Now here on the C# -sharp location, you can just paste it down. And on the right side, make sure you turned off camel case and click on the JSON button. This will generate a JSON of your class. Now what you can do is just copy down the JSON and go to a second website. I will also put the link of this new website in the description. Here if you scroll down you can you can it will ask you to enter the table name. So here I am specifying my new table and just paste your JSON. Immediately you paste the JSON you can see the columns of your table. So here if you have already an ID column it will automatically mark as key. Now if you can scroll down and you can find the create table script. Just copy the create table script. Now go back to your database. Open it. Now here I have a database called employees. Just see what's inside that. There is already an existing table called TBL employees. Now whatever we copy, we want to execute on this database. So I'm just clicking on execute. It says command completed. Now since there is already a table, let's right click and refresh. Now open the tables again and there you can see my new table. Now just in order for testing just select this table and there we go. Whatever the columns, whatever the fields inside this class is now in our database.